Alright, so I don't know what's going on with Capcom, but their Cap God status continues with the release of Street Fighter 6. Uh, it is uh, very enjoyable, uh, a lot more enjoyable than their previous uh, two Street Fighter 4 and 5. Uh, way more things to do, and it looks uh, pretty good outside of World Tour. Uh, plays great, love the animation and everything about it, and just uh, there's a lot of modes that you can play, even for beginners, casuals like myself. Uh, for veteran, pretty much, uh, you can't really ask for a better fighting game. So the game does not support ultra wide at all. So unfortunately, we get black bars for ultra wide user. Uh, in this case, though, Capcom decided to give us the gray bar instead of black bar for whatever reason, and it looks absolutely disgusting on an OLED. Wish they would just stick with the black bar. Uh, however, Prey Dog came through again and released it, his latest reframework, which includes uh, Street Fighter 6. So what you're seeing is his work here in 21 by 9. Uh, it should work with 32 by 9 as well. Outside of the gameplay, uh, there are some slight issue with the UI in the menu. Uh, but then again, this uh, mod right now is still a work in progress. So give it a shot. I'll put the link in the description. Performance-wise, it is uh, on the RE engine, so it does run pretty solid. So if you played the demo or, or the beta, uh, expect the same uh, performance, if a little bit better. And also, I noticed the graphic fidelity is a little bit better as well in the full release uh, versus the demo. Now, going back to all the game modes, one of my favorites is actually World Tour. I didn't even bother playing this mode during the demo or when it was available. Uh, because I thought it was kind of goofy. Um, I was more concerned with just the battle hub and the uh, ranked it matches. But uh, I will have to say the world tour is actually one of my favorite mode right now. There's a lot of things to do. It's very uh, casual friendly. And uh, it teaches you about the game as well. And it's a, it's a really uh, different, something different that uh, you should experience. Now, when you're in the World Tool mode or the Battle Hub, uh, you can use the mouse and keyboard or a controller to move around uh, because uh, I have a fight stick and it is impossible to uh, pan the camera with a, a fight stick. So you will, if you're using a fight stick, you will uh, have to move around your character uh, in those two modes with a controller or the mouse. But it is very easy to uh, just switch back and forth. It's a bit of a hassle, uh, especially how bulky the uh, fight stick is. But uh, that's that's the only drawdown right now. But if you're using a controller, it's not that big of an issue. But uh, if you're having a fight stick going back and forth between a controller and a fight stick uh, when you're in battle, it could be a bit of a hassle. So keep that in mind. Another awesome mode is under the practice mode, the character guide. In this mode, you pick a uh, character you want to use or learn, and the game will give you a rundown of all their abilities and how to best utilize it. At the same time, it's giving you a demonstration as you're reading this guide. So if you find a, uh, a certain move that you uh, want to practice, you can just hit a simple key and you get to practice it until uh, you succeed and you move on to the next uh, part. And it's got the combo trial as well, so you can practice your character's combo uh, with all the key input. Uh, and that's a great way to learn your character, all at the same time uh, being able to see examples as well. So it, it is actually pretty f uh, beginner friendly. I love this mode because uh, with four, uh, Street Fighter 4 and 5, I would just normally stick with Ken and call it good. Uh, didn't really bother learning any other characters because found kind of a hassle. Uh, but with this mode though, with all the um, great explanation and when best to utilize their skills, um, this mode is, is just awesome. As for the online portion, I haven't ran into any issue. Uh, able to find game perfectly fine in the battle hub uh, and casual matches. Uh, the connection has been pretty solid as well as long as, as you're searching for four or five uh, bars uh, You shouldn't have a problem and it is also cross play so there is going to be uh, Longevity in this game even with the PC version because you can play versus uh, console player 
All right, guys, so that is just my quick take on Street Fighter 6, and I will see you guys in the next video. Take care for now. Peace out. Huh?